In a world where clothes are fucked up, one man serves to not only restore, but restore them. It's not that guy. What is up and what is Gucci in your Gucci YouTube the World Wide Web? As you guys can see in Full Life HD, it is the Thrift God and... Little kinky twist. Back at you guys with a brand new video. So basically what I have up today on this episode of a quick thrift fix is I'll show you guys how I transform this jersey, which looked like a pile of shit, into this jersey, which Lil Kinky is currently wearing. So briefly, Kinky, describe where you got this jersey. So I recently moved out um, from my ex's place. Mm. And uh, you know, when I got home, Went through my clothes, found this, and you know, she broke my heart. Poor baby. So I kept the jersey. You kept it? I kept it. He stole it. Without further ado, let's get into this tutorial. Bruh, to start this tutorial out, first of all, check out the fadedness of this jersey. This thing is fucked up bedraggled, and what's even worse is it's completely fake. Now, I'm not gonna hold Lil Kinky accountable for this because he did get it for the low price of a five finger discount, so shout out to him going swiper on this shit. So the first thing I'm gonna show you guys is actually the supplies. So of course I'm using Angelus acrylic paint because number one, it is very easy to apply and number two, it is pretty much waterproof. Like when you wash this shit, it does not crack and it does not come off, so that is why I'm using it. So I got the blue first of balls to, <laughs> blue balls, to actually apply onto this jersey. Now I recommend that anyone who's a right-hander start from the left side of whatever you're painting, that way your hand does not smudge any of the wet paint. And it's vice versa if you're a lefty, AKA wrong-handed. Shout out to all my left-handed motherfuckers worldwide. So the first thing I'm doing is just filling in all the blue regions with the blue paint. It pretty much is on some preschool color in between the lines type of shit. You just basically want to color match and restore the vibrancy into the currently very faded jersey. So once the blue was done, I whipped out that dark stealth black paint and actually started whipping around the curvature of this nice little embellishment. So I'm just going along with a very sexy and ninja-like steady hand and just applying the paint. And if any of you guys do not have painting experience, the best advice I can say is just take your time, take a deep breath, and just ensure that you do not smudge and run the paint all outside the lines. Now the last taste of flavor we're gonna add on the haters is some strawberry red. Damn right delicious. So basically the red was used to lightly accent the Sixers cocaine white letters. So I'm just going in and refreshing at that paint job by adding a nice hint of strawberry atop of that. Now I was blessed that the letter three had a thicker than a snicker outline on it. So it was very simple to actually go in with a fresh coat of red paint atop of that no metal thress. So once I was done painting over the patchwork, I had to go in with a nice little pro tip, which was to whip out the nail clippers. No, I do not have a bear claw equivalent on my toe ripping through my Adidas boots, but I do have some loose stray pube-esque looking threads atop this patch. It is fake. A lot of times the more high quality gems won't have these, but I'm just using the clippers to chop down all those loose threads and just overall give a nice clean crisp finish to this piece. And we compare the old faded bedraggled jersey to the revamped, rejuvenated and restored jersey. <laughs> It's a world of a difference. Now I flip and dip the jersey on the back and actually begin the process once again. Same shit, different day, is pretty much the whole story behind the back of this jersey. The red letters, of course, very faded on the outline, so I just slapped on a brand new fresh coat of that cherry paint, and then I kept it moving, bruh. Straight up, the back of this jersey, extremely faded, and you have a magical transformation once the paint is added. So if you guys enjoyed, like, comment, and subscribe, and here's what the jersey looks like on body of Lil Kinky Twist. Check it out. Somebody that you should get used